West Virginia 511 is a free traveler information service that gives you real-time information on congestion, construction, crashes, and other events affecting traffic on the major roadways in West Virginia. You can call West Virginia 511 toll-free from your cell phone or landline to hear the latest highway reports before you hit the road. Or visit wv511.org to check traffic speeds, find traffic alerts, see traffic cameras, and check road conditions. On the West Virginia 511 website, you'll see a map of the entire state. There are several ways you can quickly access traffic information. To see a specific region of the state, you can zoom into the map or select a portion of the state under Map Views. On the left side of the screen is the legend. To see traffic speeds on all roadways, click on Traffic in the upper part of the legend. Green means traffic is moving at more than 50 miles per hour. Red means traffic is moving at less than 25 miles per hour. Click on Active Planned Events to see if there is construction or maintenance activities currently underway. Future planned events show construction projects that are planned in the near future. Under road conditions, you can see the conditions of the roadways throughout the state. Click on the small plus sign next to road conditions to see the colors assigned to the various road conditions. In the lower part of the legend, you can select other types of information. You can deselect any of the information that you do not want to see. Incidents show you the locations of traffic incidents that may affect travel speeds. Here, you can see that there's a vehicle accident on I-77 at mile marker 3 with one lane closed in each direction. Active signs shows locations of electronic roadway signs displaying traffic information. An inactive sign shows the locations of electronic roadway signs not currently displaying any traffic information. Click on cameras to see where the traffic cameras are located. When you click on one of the camera icons, you can see a live feed of the traffic camera. You can also see alerts from the National Weather Service. All this information can also be viewed in a list. Click on List Views to see incidents, events, signs, cameras, and road conditions. You can narrow down the list view when you click on a region on the right side of the screen. There are up to 20 reports per page. Click on the arrow at the bottom of the list to see additional reports. Another way to get roadway information is to click on Routes. Here, you can select a specific route. Select both directions to see information on both directions. For interstate roadways, select starting and ending mile markers. Here, you can see that there is bridge construction on I-81 at mile marker 23 with lane closures. For U.S. routes, select the intersections nearest to your starting and ending locations. Here, you can see that there is nighttime construction scheduled on U.S. 119 at West Virginia 705, and you should expect long delays. Under Resources, you'll find a list of the 12 statewide regional and roadway-specific Twitter feeds, links to download the free WV511 DriveSafe mobile app for your iPhone or Android, a list of frequently asked questions, and links to other travel and tourism agencies like airports and other 511 systems. If you have any questions or would like to provide feedback, click on Contact Us. So, before you head out to work, the airport, or a weekend getaway, visit wv511.org and know before you go.